Matt Freak 98 here and today is an exciting day for all nerds because OSX Line has come out. And from the title of this video you can tell that I will be installing Mac OS X Line today. So Mac OS X Line is um, the new operating system for Macs and it costs $32, I'll be buying it. And um, later on I'll be showing you some of the uh, features of OS X Lion in another video. So um, it's best to subscribe. So let me just hit video up over to ScreenFlow. Okay guys, so I'm at my Mac right now. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up the Mac App Store. Loading. Okay, here we go. Um, here's Mac OS X Line in the App Store. It's got information here and it's $32. In America, it'll be $30. And yeah. So let's just go and get on with it. Buy app. Okay, this is the signing bit here. Type in my password. Okay. Here we go. There we go. Ah, it's downloading now. Let's just. Does it tell you? Oh, no, it doesn't. So that is $32 guys, um, it's 3.4.9 gigs, so it's going to take a while. Okay, so, alright guys, it's telling you here, I'm downloading Mac OS X Lion, and it's going to take 1 hour and 8 minutes, so obviously I'll have to come back later, so see you guys later. So guys, um, Mac OS X Line has finished downloading, so I'm just going to go and minimize that, and here we go, continue, agree, agree, install it on this, password, okay, it's installing, alright, Okay, so let me just talk about the um, features of Mac OS X Lion. Uh, Mac OS X Lion, uh, it has this thing called Launchpad, which I'm looking forward to. Instead of having your applications folder with just, you know, all your applications here in like one little box, basically. Here, the box, yeah, um, you get the whole screen with all your apps, like an iPad style kind of thing. And um, I'm also looking forward to the full screen apps because I uh, I really need the full screen apps. I don't like dragging it out and making it full screen uh, because that's what you get on Windows. Like if you just click the maximize button, you get the full screen. And on Mac, that doesn't really happen. So I'll talk about some of the more features after I install this. So it's telling me to restart. I'm just gonna go ahead and stop this video. Hi, right, so I'm officially officially on OSX line right now. I can't show you because ScreenFlow is not working for me right now. So I'll get that fixed and uh, I'm gonna have a lot more videos on OSX line because there are good and bad things to it, such as the scrolling. Scrolling uh, is really frustrating right now for me. Because if you, on Snow Leopard, if you move your finger upwards, then it would go up the page. And if you moved it down, it would go down. But now it's the other way around and it's very frustrating because, you know, you got used to the other way. And now you have to get to used to the other way. And um, some more interesting things are, like the two swipe thing, when you're in like Safari and things like that, how you would just swipe like that. Um, how that would take you from page to page, from tab, yeah, page to page. Now what it does is it moves the whole screen over and then shows you like what you've got open. It's like switching between apps. And if you want to switch between pages, you have to do it with three, three fingers. And that's very hard if you have a magic mouse. So guys, rate, comment and subscribe. And please leave a comment down below because I'll have a lot more videos coming. and. 
um, I'm gonna make some videos not only on Mac OS X line, but the new MacBook Airs uh, and the new Thunderbolt port display things that Apple came out with and the new Mac Mini. Okay, so rate, comment, subscribe, guys. See you guys later.